what are the different uh, techniques to get the uh, tabular or diagrammatic representation of data? One is bar graph. Second is histogram. Third is frequency. Polygon. One is bar graph, second is histogram, and third is frequency polygon. That must be frequency F R E Q U E N C Y. Third is frequency polygon. Now, first we are discussing the bar graph. What is bar graph? To understand the bar graph, let's take an example. Suppose uh, let's have an example of our household expenditure. Household expenditure, just write that in terms of thousand rupees. Suppose in Kitchen household expenditure, milk, one uh, item is milk, and in milk we need to spend 1000 rupees, right? Uh, electricity, again electricity, we spend 3000 rupees, okay? Uh, and Ghee or butter, we spend 1500 rupees, suppose, in milk, electricity, ghee, butter, egg. We spend 500 rupees, right? And suppose in water bill, we spend again 500 rupees for that, okay? Now, how we can convert this data using bar graph? How we can convert this particular data using bar graph. Bar graph is a graphical representation of data. Bar graph is a graphical representation of data. That means bar graph can be done on graph paper. In graph paper, there are two axes, x axis and y axis. On x axis, we take the different commodity or the different expenditure. And on the y-axis, we term the expenditure in terms of rupees, okay, in thousand. Y represent the rupees in thousands. So, let's say this is one, this is two thousand, this is for three thousand, this is for four thousand, okay. Zero, one, two, three, four, Five, six. Milk. Let's say this one to two point is representing milk. Now milk in milk uh, we spend thousand rupees. So we take from here to here. This represents the expenditure on milk. Similarly. For electricity, 3 to 4, we would take electricity. For electricity, we are spending 3000 rupees. So, 
So this represents this particular bar. Why this is known as bar graph? 